couple people out here and a vehicle stopped. Here. He says somebody hit him with a car. He's obviously been drinking, but he needs some help. So I didn't want to leave until somebody got here. I appreciate you. And when you came here, you didn't see anybody else around? Or? You know what? There was a white vehicle on the tracks, and I think they saw him about the same time we did. Okay. But they went on. But you didn't see a vehicle around or anything like anything. that? Okay. But his head's all busted up. And he said he hurt Why don't you thing. guys go ahead and pull up to give room for the ambulance? We're going to go on. We just wait. Well, I need your information real quick. What information? Just your information real quick. Give me what one second. Can you just pull the vehicle up for a second? It's not my car. Jesus Christ. Give me your IDs and I'll run it now. Everybody's got to make shit, shit rocket science. You got your ID on you? It's not my car. I you have your ID on no, you. No, I do not. Why are you yelling at me whenever I'm Because you're not listening. You're not listening. I'm trying to get the ambulance here so we can get off the railroad tracks. And we're going home. I need your ID. I don't have an ID. What's your name? I'm not giving it to you. I'm going to put your hands behind your back. I'm going to arrest you. God damn, let's make everything fucking difficult, please. You want to go sit in the county jail because you want to be an idiot. I don't have an ID on me. Just like no, you don't want to give me your name, so you said arrest you. So good lord, let's make shit difficult. Makes sense. I want to see your supervisor. Put him, put him in your car. Pat him down and put him in your car. Yes, you have. Obstructing justice. Put him, put him in your car. Pat him down and put him in your car. I want to see your supervisor. Have I committed a crime? Yes, you what? have. Obstructing justice. How is that when I called to get this Come guy on. some help? Come on. That's all I did was call to get help. I did nothing. You got anything in your pocket? Left? I got my cigarette. Left I got my pajama pants on, man. We just saw the guy laying in the road. If I haven't been suspected of a crime. I know, I or just got, I just got of being called about this guy. About him. Yeah, I mean, we're just trying to help. All right. And the guy's yelling at me. That's what's the matter with the police force nowadays, man. Well, let's get this, fig get this figured out. And I did yeah. absolutely nothing but called to help this guy out, and I'm sitting here in cuffs. That's all I did. Well, what happened? What happened I there? don't know. We pulled up, and the guy's laying in the middle of the road, so we called 911. We up, asking me for ID, which I told him I do not have. And I haven't been I haven't been suspected of committing a crime. What's your name? It's Aaron. Okay. But there's absolutely no reason to ID me when I haven't done anything. I'm just trying to help a guy. D um, whenever you called about it, did you? I didn't even call. Oh. My Go daughter ahead. called. I was out there with the man. They pulled up right after he was down. They didn't okay. see anything, but just right. first ones on Did nothing, man. And here I'm sitting in cuffs because your guy's an asshole. That's why. I want your supervisor out here, by the way. Get your he's out. He's out here. All right. That's why people record this stuff, you know that, right? You're breaking my constitutional rights by arresting me for committing no crime. Well, I was in an investigation. All right, well, I don't know what was going on there, so... Nothing. I, I call, we called to get the guy some help, and I'm in cuffs. All right, well, let me go talk to them, and hopefully we'll be able to get you out of here. Okay. Also run an Aaron W. There you go, that's I'll me. I'll get a date of birth for you in a moment. Your Aaron, guy was just wait, being wait. an asshole. Aaron, listen, if you want to see asshole, I'll send you to the county jail. I'm asking for cooperation here. God damn. Who is this guy to you, ma'am? Who is he to you? He's my dad. Why is he acting like this when I'm trying to get people off the railroad tracks for safety I reasons? Know, sir. I'm sorry. I just need to know who we are. That's all I'm doing. I'm just asking him for his name and he don't want to give it to me. We were just trying to get this man Ma'am, I appreciate that, but at the same time, no, why cause one problem when we're trying to fix another? You know what I'm saying? I so, Trey, copy 28 of a witness.
They pulled up right after he was down. They didn't see anything, but just first ones on scene. B Boy K King 92678. Boy King 92678. Copy 27. Go ahead. Last name. First is Molly. M O L L I. Middle A Adam. Female. Here you go, darling. What's his name? What's his middle initial? Um, w. W. Also run a Aaron W. I'll get a date of birth for you in a moment. Aaron, wait, wait. Aaron, listen. If you want to see asshole, I'll send you to the county jail. I'm asking for your cooperation here. For what? I've got squad cars on railroad tracks. I'm Why trying to get them off of it because you don't want to listen. I'm asking for your cooperation, and you don't want to give it to me. No, my cooperation was calling and getting this man some help. Okay, so we're going to cause another problem by not clearing the railroad tracks? I'm, I'm asking you to pull it's forward. It's not my car. And then I'm asking for your name so you guys can get out of here so for we can no pull forward. For no reason at all. For no reason. You're yeah, asking that, makes, that makes sense. Fucking stupid. This guy just wants to be a fucking idiot. Hit your unlocks on your car. Aaron, I don't know why you'd want to do a good deed and not help me try to just get everybody out of here in a safe you know area. Well, you started yelling at me with a bad deal right off the bat, so... Apparently you don't know what it's like to do this job. I don't. 
Don't want to. I get that, but, but I'm, tra I'm like trying to. to I'm trying to make it safe for everybody showing up here, so we're not on railroad tracks. Well, you need and to stuff. get the chip off your shoulder, pal. There's no reason to be rude. Oh no! Listen, time can kill somebody. You understand that? I'm not mad. Why are you? Time can. I'm not mad. Why you keep yelling at me then? Time. I'm not yelling. Not right now. Time can kill somebody. The matter of seconds can kill somebody. I There's have a no idea what happened to him. No more than you do. I understand I that. I'm trying to get people off the railroad tracks. And I'm trying to go home. I just have to help the then guy. Then just help me get to the fucking end I don't of the. Oh, you anything? I don't know what your problem is. My problem is is what? what I'm clear, right? My I've lived here my entire life. I want your name, your card. It's Billy White. My badge number is four two nine. Because there'll be a complaint filed. I guarantee you. You know what? If you're going to file a complaint, we'll just charge you. Stay in there. Charge we'll give you something. To, we'll give you something to file a complaint on. Transport this one to the station. He's going to run his mouth and want to file a complaint. I'll give him something to file his complaint on. You can you can go to the station and bond him out. Ah oh, damn. I don't owe you anything. I don't know what your problem is. My problem is... And guess what? what? I'm clear, right? My, I've, I've lived here my entire life. I want your name, your card. It's Billy White. My badge number is 429. Because there'll be a complaint filed. I guarantee you. You know what? If you're going to file a complaint, we'll just charge you. Stay in there. So charge we'll me then. For what? We'll For what? what? File a complaint on. You know it's bullshit, right? Well, I, I gotta take you up there, I guess. I know. It's not your fault, pal. I'm not mad at you. I just actually got angry because he was yelling at me for no reason at all. I'm just trying to help somebody. I'm clear. I'm valid. I got nothing against me, and I've been here all my life in Central Illinois. Same house for 20 years, pal. But I don't have to put up with somebody yelling at me when I'm trying to help somebody, and that's what it amounts to. He got aggressive with me. He's yelling. He's demanding things, and I don't have to give him anything. I've committed no crime here. Nabolski, can you get by or no? So take me to the police station. What's he going to charge me yeah, with? What crime is he charging Probably me you. with? Do you know? Um, I, I don't know yet. That's because there was no crime, pal. You know that. No crime. <laughs> I wasn't impeding an investigation. I don't know any more about it than you guys do. I gave your, I gave your smokes and stuff to her. It's my daughter. There was lo no lawful commands given because I wasn't under suspicion of a crime, nor was I under the suspicion of committing a crime. There was no reason for him to be aggressive with me at all, and he was still aggressive at the car. So he said, if I'm going to file a report against him, he's going to charge me. That's why we're going to the police station. Now, see, you guys can't be all all bad, man. God damn it, you just can't be. I have a hard time believing that you all act like that. I understand that you're going to do what your partner says, you know, your buddy. But bottom line is it's definitely against my constitutional rights, and I've committed no crime at all. And you guys took an oath to uphold constitutional rights, did you not? Yep. And you're breaking mine now. I've done nothing. And you know that. Well, 
Well, he's got more information than I do. He got there before I did, so. <laughs> and I, and as soon as you got there, I was putting your car because I didn't have an ID on me. I was given no lawful orders because I was not under arrest for anything, nor was I being detained for anything. I committed no crime. And because I wanted to file a report on him, he said, charge me, take me to the police station. And that's where we're going. I pay my tax dollars here too. got a big chip on his shoulder and you know the citizens of Centralia need to stop letting this happen. You guys are aggressive. Is there anything else to indicate that he did not fall? I don't know if he fell or not. He was laying there when I got there. You can't tell with the various tracks. I don't see anything that suggests that he was hit by a car, especially not the way he got up and walked to the ambulance. And that's just what he told me while he was laying yeah, there. That's what I was thinking also. And I told him that much. The guy was laying there. I don't know what happened. He said he got hit by a car. He said to move the car. I said we was on our way home. Level of intoxication. He started screaming at me. That's where it went. It's not my car to move, so how am I going to move the car? I don't even drive. So I'll tell you we're out back with one. The man said he was going to arrest me. I put my hands behind my back. Right? No resisting. Joker. No co crime committed. No, when a cop asks you your name, you have to tell them. It's a, it's a, a state, lawful order. No, it's a state law. I gave you a lawful order. Stand over here. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't have no idea to give you. Back to, I asked for your name. You said, I, I don't have to give it to you. I'm well, leaving. I want to see the state code where it says I have Into to give my name if I'm not. It's a state law. Sorry. Everything I'm saying is recorded. It's a state law. Here? Yes. All right. Have a seat for me. I got it. Here? No, you can sit up here. Aaron, my name is Billy White, by the way. I think I know you, actually. I think we might have went to school together. We did? You go to Central High School? I did. What year did you graduate? Oh, uh, what was it, 91, I think? That was my brother. My brother graduated, yeah, with you. I graduated in 95. Aaron, listen, I've done this for 22 years. It is a state law, okay? If this guy wakes up, I'm covering you and I'm covering me. I, you know what, you know as much as I did. He was laying on the ground when we got Buddy, I understand that, but you got to follow me real quick. I, I don't plan on charging you, just so you know. I'm going to cut you out of here in about 30 seconds. All I'm telling you is, he wakes up and says, that white car hit me. Don't you want me to be able to establish who was in the car from my standpoint? I can understand I, that. I, I, have, I have to, Aaron, listen, I have to by state law. I have to know who you are. I have to know who's reporting it. He might wake up and say, this guy in this white car got out and hit me. I can say, I talked to this guy. This guy's the caller. I can say that there was nothing. If you're avoiding I me. Well, I, I don't know that. But what I'm saying well, is. I was just there. But, but to be honest with you, Aaron, my biggest concern is trains. There was a train backing up. My bumper's on the railroad tracks. I had to stop short because he's laying on the ground. I want to make sure. I understand that. That's why we ended up seeing But there are switch the there are switches and he was backing up. But what I'm saying is yeah, I got my slippers on, right? I got you, buddy. Listen to me real quick, okay? I've had a long day. I've done this for I've had a long day too. Uh, I've done this for twelve hours, so all I'm saying is I appreciate you calling us. I got no disrespect for you, pal. Listen, all I gotta do is my job. I have to know who is on scene. And I gotta get I was trying to get your guys' car moved so ambulance and, and fire is gonna block you guys I just in. I wanted to go home. I got you. I'm going to get you out of here.
they're going to block you all in, and I was trying to get you out of there as quick as possible, but I can't have all these first responders stopping on the railroad tracks and not being able to get through. All I was trying to do is get... Get aggressive. That's what he was. He was aggressive. And that's what, that's what got me. Wouldn't, wouldn't you have to be if you got a guy that's not listening and you got the potential? I don't have to listen to you just because you got a badge on, though. You know that, right? I'm quite aware. But when you're there at the scene... Trying to get somebody some help, pal. I understand. You know what's going to happen from this? Aaron, less people are going to try to stop and help other people because of what Aaron, happened here. that's not what I'm trying to accomplish. That's exactly what's going to happen. Because I'll be no. going to stop and go through this again and have a cop screaming in my face just for trying to help somebody. All right, I thought we were on the same page, but listen. I'm and not, I respect what you do, and I appreciate what if, you do. If you do, then you'll get where but I don't owe you anything. When I show up, you actually do by state law. I hate to say that, but well, I show have... Show me the law, then. Show me the law where Illinois says that you have to ID. When a cop shows up on a, on a crime, potential crime scene, accident scene, whatever it is, I have the right to know who's there. Well, I want to see the law where it says... I have that right. I want to see the law. Can I not see it? Can you not pull it up? Can you not pop it on your phone and say, Aaron Flanagan, here's the law, so next time it's, I will know? It's case law. If you want to wait here long enough for me to go research it and pull it up, I'll do it. No, see, you should already have that, right? See, oh, you, oh, you want to use argue, man. I don't want to argue. I just want you to know that people have a right. I'm telling you what the law is. Constitutional rights. Aaron, okay? I'm telling you what the law is. Listen, I'm telling you Are what you the... Are you a lawyer? I mean, you know this for a fact. See, you like, know, I, like I said, all you... Just let me go, all right? Or, you, you're, 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 argue, no, you're, you're free to go. All you want to do is argue. So that's that's obvious. And what's your name? It's Billy White. Billy White? What's I've already name? told you Remember? three times, man. You know what? I got a brain tumor, and all you did was stress me out, so... Centre is his right up front or out back. You're, you're free to go either way. Front door or back door. I don't see one out back. Nobody came in the lobby. All right. Probably ain't got no ride. The well, chief is following us up here. Have a good one. Well, you be safe, pal. I appreciate you. Things we're kind of on the aggressive side. Just be safe out there, okay? Because I do appreciate what you guys do. Listen, just trying to do a job, up brother. Front. Have a good one. Hey, she's up. She's up front, actually, if you want to go through there. Be safe, though. I appreciate right. you. Next time, try to take it easy. I would have been more able Listen, to just trying to get a job done. Yell at me, all right? Yeah, sometimes seconds can get somebody killed, man. Don't yell at me. Okay? Seconds can get somebody hurt, brother. You know, yelling ain't going to help you out. It just took more time. Not listening to the police ain't going to help either, man. Have a good one, Aaron. Take care, brother.